Now for Australia, Australia is falling away. This is what God says. In fact, Australia has fallen away and Australia will be punished with floods. So the words that the Lord gave me were four places and I haven't had time to even look them up, but I did write what I heard and it's the University of Queensland, Queensland, Victoria and Auckland. The Lord says that these places will have record numbers of sickness, disease, and death, and that this place called Queensland will go underwater. So it's either going to sink and go underwater, or it's going to experience flooding to the point where it will effectively be underwater. I am not sure. But I saw this area called Queensland in Australia, and it was like a basin that was filling up with this very eerie, non-transparent blue water. It's the kind of blue water that you find in those hidden caves, you know, where the water is not so transparent, but it's so, so azure, so blue and eerie looking. And that's what I saw that Queensland was filling up with that greenish blue turquoise kind of water. And it was 70% covered. It was 70% covered. And God said that this will be the punishment for sin. And he also said that this place called Victoria will be affected by water. And I found this word very strange because we all know that though Australia is an island, meaning it's right there in the middle of the sea, it is a very hot and dry place as far as I know. It's not known for flooding and it's not known for having an abundance of rainfall, but God did say that water will affect that continent for sin. And this is the word to Australia. I will punish you for godlessness. I will punish you for secularism and for putting me aside from you. I lit a candle in you. In fact, I did more than that. I lit a very bright lamp in your midst and out of you, Christianity blazed forth and it covered the world. You started a revolution. You lifted the name of Jesus and the nations flocked into their temples to worship the God who is called Yah. But look at you now. You're cold and you have fallen. You have a form of godliness, but you deny the righteous power thereof. You have fallen away. You have become reprobate. You no longer worship me. You no longer shine like a lamp that calls the nations to worship. You have become lukewarm. And so I will spit you out of my mouth. Repent and do the first works. 